All right, so it's time to buy your next guitar. Are you gonna go over to the shop and grab a Fender Strat? Maybe you're looking for something like a workhorse Tele. Or maybe you're gonna grab something really familiar like a Gibson Les Paul. But what about something that's kind of out there? What about that guitar standing in the corner of the shop that looks really different than the rest? I've had a couple weeks to get to know these RKS guitars and they're really phenomenal. Let's check them out. Full disclosure, RKS guitars are not being manufactured right now. So, you can't go grab a new one, but you can find some on Reverb, and there are some used ones available for sale if you do some digging. Now that said, the year is 2000, Robbie Sawney of RKS Design, an industrial design firm, takes on a side project to reinvent the electric guitar. And what he does is he partners with Dave Mason, guitarist, songwriter, singer, credits everywhere from Jimi Hendrix to George Harrison. Go look him up. Very impressive. So they set out to completely recreate the human experience with the electric guitar. And here's where they landed. And you know what? Here's also where they landed. These are really cool ergonomic designs, never seen anything like it, but what's really incredible is although they look super modern, they have this really comfortable, really familiar feel. The orange guitar I was just holding feels just like a vintage telly when you're playing it. This guy, not a far departure from a Music Man neck. It's got a Les Paul-ish kind of tone, even a Gibson Flying V feel and tone, I mean, really. What I thought would make the most sense was I'll put up some close-up images and some close-up videos, and I'll walk through some of the specifications on each of these guitars. After that, we'll get some sounds in the room ranging from clean tone, edge of breakup, and then some pretty high gain stuff, at least high gain for me. And then after that, Maybe we'll throw a track together that really highlights the two guitars all in one, and then we'll do a bit of a wrap up. So let's get started. Okay, this first guitar from RKS, I'll just call the orange one. To reinvent the electric guitar experience, what RKS did was create this central core of a neck through body design. And what happens here is all of the electronics, including the pickup selector switch and the volume and tone pots are contained in this one central unit. It's connected to a semi-hollow body with aluminum ribs, and the semi-hollow body itself is constructed with a wood composite material. The end result is something that's incredibly ergonomic, it feels great, it looks incredibly modern, yet it feels like a vintage telly. The neck feels incredible, it's smooth, the finish is perfect, it's got modern locking tuners, it's got an iconic RKS designed headstock, which looks really cool. And then from the user interface standpoint, the pickup selector switch and the volume and tone pot are on the center of this center body structure. It really creates something with the guitar that's easy to manipulate while playing, while not getting in the way, which is pretty interesting. It's a neat feature. This guitar has a four-way selector switch and the pickups on here they feel and sound like single coils. It's not my guitar, I'm not going to take it apart to find out, but they are something special. And the sound of this guitar is something like a Tele, but it's a little bit more. It's a Tele Plus, and I don't know how else to describe it. I hope it comes through in the recordings. The second RKS guitar that I've had the pleasure to spend some time with is their Iluru model, and it's a Flying V-ish design. It's got the same exact neck through body center construction. This has a solid wood body that's connected to the back, directly connected to the center structure. It's got neck and bridge humbuckers, really nice open articulate sounding, and it's got the same controls, at least the same control layout as the orange guitar. The same very modern RKS neck and modern locking tuners. The neck itself on this one, incredible satin finish, very fast playing, but it really feels just like a brand new Music Man guitar. Medium jumbo frets. It's a really nice guitar. It's got a five-way switch, volume and tone pots. 
Just a really cool example of a different take on the electric guitar.
If you take away nothing else from this video, aside from how ridiculously cool these Archaeus guitars really are, I hope it's that you don't always have to go right to a Fender Strat or a Telecaster or a Les Paul, something super familiar. I think it's probably worth experimenting with other things out there. It's worth seeing what other manufacturers have to offer because these guitars are something that I might not have selected myself, but after playing them, I think they're incredible and I could do an entire gig with just one of these. If you like this video and you like the other videos on this channel, like the video, like and subscribe the channel. There's a lot more content that I've got coming out. There's a lot more content that I'm currently working through and filming. I'm working on some gear reviews. I'm working on some demos. I'm working on some DIY stuff and some considerations. And I'm also working on some new lessons to get you out there and crushing it on stage. See you there.